Gang, what's the deal, man? What's the word? How y'all feeling? Hold on, let me get my shit right. Real with me. Yeah, we brought on, we back. But look, though. Hey, man, today, I got a rep for the homies, man, you know? I got to let y'all women know things women do that us men don't like, that us, that we don't like. We don't be really feeling it like that, you know? Women, they look at it like they can do anything, and the fact that they're women, a woman... That's supposed to be cool. That's supposed to just be like, nah, it don't work like that. So we finna get straight into this. You feel me? Word up. You gotta keep it funky, man. You gotta be honest, you know. You can't just pick your tools, you know. But it's crazy. Like a lot of women nowadays, I can tell y'all five things for a fact I know men don't like that women do nowadays. Per my personal experience and just in general. Unless a woman got like a, a business going for herself, she really she gotta use it. A nigga really don't like no woman that's on social media twenty four seven, them Snapchats and them Instagrams and all that. Like niggas not really feeling that. You feel me? Like the they not. We not. We don't be. We with a woman and she got her phone up twenty four seven. That shit gets annoying. Like damn, you a chicken head. You feel me? Like you always on the phone. Niggas really can't even get intimate and personal, intimate and personal with a woman that's always on the phone, that's always on Snapchat every five seconds. She want to record every fucking thing y'all do. She always on Instagram, always on social media, is letting the world know what the business is. We don't like that shit, man. We do not like that shit at all. That shit. I get people got to be on social media or they might want to interact or whatever, but we don't really like that shit when it's all day. Like, women would literally be on the phone all day. Like, on social media, it's all day. Niggas do not be trying to be around that. Number two, as crazy as it sounds, hygiene, man. Y'all make sure that hygiene is right, man. Make sure that pH balance right. Make sure y'all doing whatever y'all got to do to woman suave to make sure that thing good, man. Because some of y'all gardens of Edens be a little, you feel me, a little... Little, little smelly, you feel me? Smell like some rotten fruits in that garden, you feel me? I don't know what the fuck be going on down there. Garden end up got some seafood in that shit, man. Damn, rotten vegetables, rotten fruits. Y'all make sure that shit good, man. You know, cause God, especially if you grown, there's no reason. It's no reason at all. It's unacceptable. It's unacceptable. Why? The garden of Eden should be even remotely smelling bad. Even remotely. Like, nah. That's something y'all got to keep on track every day. Like, ugh. And I say that because you would be surprised, man. Like, God damn. And it be strong, too. And then it be so fucked up, homies, because they act like they can't smell it, right? They act like they don't know what's wrong. Like, man, you know you smell that shit. Like, go fix that shit. <laughs> They'll try to play it off like, bro, you know you stink, bro. Like, go clean that shit up. You feel me? Shit be weird as fuck, right? What was that? Number two, I'll finna spaz, man. That shit, ugh. That shit, ugh. Number three, though. Number three, we don't really like no women that's in drama all the time. You feel me? Now, we ain't seeing a woman gotta be passive and shit like that. Just let people walk over. But niggas don't be really wanting no woman that's always in drama, always in beef, you feel me? Unless it come to her and she got to defend herself. But a woman that's just on the internet, wilding, tweaking, you feel me? Just always in drama, always in something like that shit bring a headache, you feel me? A, we don't like women that's lazy. Like, be productive. Have a grind about yourself, you feel me? Go Be a go-getter, like, damn, do something, you feel me? Like, some women, they just expect just because they got the little, the little pussy or whatever, they just supposed to be good. Like, nah, it take more than that, you feel me? It take way more than that, way more than that. All right, you might, you might, okay, you might, you got the pussy, you might sweep up a little bit or something, but nah, it take way more than that, man. Be productive and shit, you know? I don't think nobody don't want nobody that's unproductive, so definitely be productive, you feel me? Us, we don't like niggas that's, I mean, we don't like women that's, ran through the whole block done hit. Nobody don't want no woman that that's like that. The whole block done hit, you feel me? She all on everybody phone, you feel me? Like, who wants something like that, you know? Well, some of the niggas, they still be claiming it, and they be wifing them up, but 
That shit weird too. You feel me? <laughs> Word up. For real, for real. Word. We don't really like women that don't really treat, say, her parents or family, her kids, whatever, with respect, you know? Like, we know this shit like that, like, how she act around her family, her friends, and people and shit like that, you know? Like, if, they, if she act one way with you and then another way with them, like, we don't really like shit like that, you feel me? You know? Another thing, we don't like women that's insecure. Like, don't be all on our bumper 24-7. That's what make niggas want to go do the shit they do. Because we like, damn, man, we got this girl. She always fucking nagging. And then be so fucked up because we as the homies, we really be doing good sometimes. You feel me? Like, majority of the time, the niggas be doing good. But then it's like, you always getting accused of some shit you ain't do. Eventually, you're going to either leave or you're going to go do the shit that you being accused of. You feel me? Because they be like, damn, why you talking to this bitch and this bitch and this bitch? It's like, bro, I ain't even talking to them, you feel me? But since you keep putting your na they name in your mouth, I might as well go cracker, you feel me? Since you always doing, being extra and shit, nobody want no, want no insecure girl, no jealous, like, well, jealous is cool, like, being jealous over her man or whatever, I get that, you know, like, she don't want women, you know, always talking, like, I get that, you feel me? But I'm just saying in general, like, you got something good going for yourself, she jealous of that, like, believe it, it happens, you feel me? But, man... We be looking for y'all to be, you feel me, like the woman, you know? Like y'all nurturing this shit, y'all caring and shit like that. So it's like, when y'all always thinking the worst, that brings stress to a nigga for real. Like y'all supposed to be our stress reliever, not our stress. You feel me? Like, golly, boy, as soon as a nigga walk in the crib, already, boy, I'm talking about you ain't even goddamn took the shirt off. You ain't even walked to the room yet. I'm talking about as soon as you open the door, as soon as she hear that shit crack, you feel me? She sitting right there on the couch, nigga. She been thinking for two hours on what she finna say. <laughs> she been thinking for two hours on what she finna say, nigga. She got everything. She already know what you finna respond with and everything, nigga, with my word, you feel me? That should be crazy as fuck, man, for real. <laughs> for real, man. Another thing, some niggas, they don't like women that can't cook, you feel me? They they look at that as a deal breaker. Like, oh, she can't cook, she ain't no good, you feel me? And then some, you know, they look at it like, oh, she cooked, that's good, you know? On that one, that really all depends on the man, because, I mean, everybody different, like, you know? I feel like us men, you feel me? Us learning how to cook is a good skill, you feel me? Of course, to have, like, so even if we single or whatever, we can still feed ourselves, you feel me? Like, that's always a good skill, you know, to have and shit like that. Like, word up. But, um, yeah, man, what's some other shit? Y'all homies help me out, man. Y'all, It's a whole bunch of shit. Y'all help me out, mate. What's some else? Man. <laughs> what's some else, man? We don't really like women that act one way and then in public, she be on, like, she be extra and shit, like, man, she don't even act like that for real, like, why you acting like that, you feel me, or, like, she'll be cool with you, lovey-dovey, then she get around friends, and she be trying to damn play you and shit, like, you don't even, like, what the fuck, you feel me, like, just that weird shit, like, be believe it, like, women do that, like, I don't know what that shit be, that shit be weird, like, so it be kind of hard to tell what's going on, you feel me, like, I don't know. Some niggas cool with that. But me, personally, I'm a straight suitor. So, we getting straight to the point. Like, I don't need all that mixed signals and you one way this day, then you one way. Like, nah. You feel me? Be straight through with me, personally. Like, that shit be kind of weird, too, though. And it's like, that shit, I don't know. You know? Shit kind of fool. It's kind of tricky and shit. For real. But, yeah, man, that's just a little bit of the basics of the shit we don't really like. You feel me? Ain't, we ain't really into shit like that. You feel me? You know, I mean, what's some other stuff that we don't really like? Hmm. Of course, we don't like no woman that's no liar. You know, lie about anything, small details to the large ones. You know, we don't like no women that's no liar. We don't like women that be doing shit for attention. You know. Going all out extra for the attention. Just or, or wanna be seen, wanna be in the spotlight so bad. Like niggas, they be wanting a woman that's a, a real woman, you know, that's low key by our business. Like, we don't want a woman that's all extra and this and that and you know, 
But uh, yeah, man, I ain't gonna press the line on y'all women so hard, man. You know, I ain't gonna press y'all so hard because we all playing hella offense. But I had a, I had to go for my niggas, man. You know, I had a had a rep for the homies, man. Cause a lot of niggas be going through bullshit with women, but it's never put on the front line. You know, it be a lot of du double standards when it come to men and women, and it really don't be fair. And women know that. You feel me? They know it be double standards sometimes. They do. Everybody do. You know, but. Yeah, man, like, comment, subscribe. If y'all think some uh, some other stuff that men might not like or women, you know, y'all put y'all input on it. You feel me? I can't speak from a woman perspective, obviously. But, you know, it's all love. I'm a rep for y'all, too. You feel me? Word up. So, shout out everybody that's rocking with us, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Tap in. Hit the email. Hit the Instagram. Get at me. Gang!